Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. You're watching Big Fish Lad. And if you're new to the channel, my name is Paul. Also guys, if you are watching this regular, or you are new and you like the content, please consider subscribing. It's free of charge. Click the subscribe button, ping the bell, and that will give you notifications as when I do any other videos. Okay, so today we're gonna to talk about the upgrade that we've given to Jagger the Red Devil and his little female Midas that he lives with. Um, obviously, you know that I've took some tanks down. What we had to think about as well was, did Jagger need an update, uh, update, an upgrade? And he did, he needed an upgrade. So we've had to prioritize him because he's really important. He will be the last fish to leave this fish room. So we needed to give him that upgrade. So we've given him the upgrade. So I'm gonna show you now and talk to you about how much more um, how much more water as such he's got in room and why we've done it so let's head over to Jagger's tank okay so I'm just going to show you from a long shot just to show you you've seen this tank before I've got a couple of these sorry I'm sorry about the glare guys but this tank always has a glare now Unless I do the videos when it's pitch black outside from the window, we're not go we're, we're going to get the glare. And obviously, it's going dark around about eleven at night, so I'm in bed by that time, guys. Anyway, I'll do my best to can to get good footage of him. But yeah, so I'm showing you from a distance. It is a 450 liter tank. You've seen it before. It's five foot long, twenty inches wide, and twenty four inches high. It is about 125 US gallons made by Maidenhead which is a company that so actually it's not made by Maidenhead it's sold by Maidenhead. Maidenhead are a company that are in the UK they've got um, aquatic stores all over the UK and um, there is quite a lot about very renowned very renowned uh, company and uh, they stock these it's Aqua One that make them another very renowned company and I'll be dead honest with you I paid 600 and 90 pound for this tank and it comes with your tank your unit your hood the unit sliders it's an absolute bargain in my opinion and they're just some of the best tanks that i have ever had and at that price when you think the jewels the dual tank of the same size is over a thousand pound so value for money these are fantastic and i'll be dead honest with you the glass is a better quality as well so anyway, right, so we've moved him and the little female Midas into this tank because when we was taking the tanks down, I said to Joe that my only worry is that if we get it wrong, it's going to be too small, that tank. Now, I did, I did originally think that 350 litres would have been okay. Now, that was just for him. I still don't believe now that that is big enough for him, but because he's got her, and if you look at her, you can see her on the right-hand side, she has grown no end. We got her when she was 1.5 inches, and she's now probably 5 inches, so growing really well. Um, so, yeah, so I wanted to upgrade him. So we, we what we did was when, when, cause you, when we decided to take the other tanks down, we talked about it properly, and she was saying to me, like, you know which fish do you want to keep so which fish are not going anywhere and we prioritize those fish and we put them where we think they're going to be okay for at least the next six months that's what we have to think about so we have to move these guys into here so let's get a bit closer sorry i'm pulling my chair along so yeah so as you can see we basically lifted and shifted what was in his tank into here so the, the the uh, cave for her, the big daft um, terracotta cave, which is about, I reckon that's about 20 inches, you know. Um, the stones to stop him being able to get in and the wood just for her to get around and about. Just, just That wood basically gives her a couple of options to get out of the way if she can't get in the cave. And it just works. So, like I said, there she is. Coming out. So, she, yeah, she, she's growing so fast. Um, and she's she's a little she's a stunning little fish. She's you know, she's your normal cat type Midas. Look, he wants to photobomb. She's just your normal yellow. I, I don't know if she's piebald. I can't think if she's piebald. Um, she is just your normal type Midas. 
he is a red devil and he is stunning but actually i'm going to say it again because i always say it they could be my devils i think actually now every bloody red devil and midas is classed as a my devil so red devil midas my devil i don't care i really don't care i love this fish and in my opinion in my opinion he is one of the nicest red devils that I've ever seen in person. He is a stunner and I'll tell you something, it's 15 months since I've, I bought him. Now, I thought he was big when I got him, but he has put some size on. Honestly, he's probably 12 inches now. Um, it was about 10 inches when I got him. He might even be bigger than 12 inches now, but he's put girth on as well. I was looking at pictures the other day of him uh, when I first got him and I thought, oh my God, he has absolutely grown so much since then. Still as stunning, he was stunning then and he's stunning now. And it's the same old story. He is an aggressive, um, personable, funny, uh, you know, whatever. He just He's just got everything, look, look at him. He's just got everything. He's just got a great personality. Although, the Jag, when I show you the Jag, the Jag is like a little puppy. So the Jag is like, he's very, he's very personable. So I wouldn't say that Red, the, the, the Jag is the, um, most personable fish in the fish room because that new jag has given him a run for his money she again still got loads of loads of growing room to get in with that pot that pot will last for a long time he can't get in the pot so it's business as usual for these guys um and now they've got this much more i mean you can see it in you know you can see it just by in this video how much more room what i should have done was i should i should have videoed him in this 350 litre just to show you I, I was looking at it I, I think it's been in this tank now probably two weeks but I was looking at it and I was thinking wow he has absolutely outgrown that tank so yeah we made the decision we're not you know we life's good at the moment we're getting out we're doing a lot of hiking life's good unfortunately right now <coughs> sorry unfortunately right now the fish are not the most important thing so yeah, they don't. They come second to my health and Joe's sanity, and obviously the hiking. We, uh, you know, we're enjoying ourselves. So it works at the moment. I am thinking of taking another tank down. To be honest with you, um, just because it's just it's going well. You know, we've made the right decision. I know a lot of people said to me that you know tried to give me advice, and I know they were they meant well, and I love the fact that you mean well. But we've made the right decision. We're enjoying our lives. We're having a break. Um, not going to fish shops it's brilliant it's only been a couple of weeks don't get me wrong a few weeks maybe three weeks but it's just nice and we intend to extend it but like I said this guy ain't going anywhere he is the probably the most liked fish in this fish room so not that many people come because of COVID, but if anybody does come, even the grandkids. So the grandkids come, and even Thomas, my grandson, who is um, three, makes a beeline for him all the time. So he's very, very, very well liked. So he is the mascot of the fish room. Um, we have still got the Trimac, obviously. So I've split the Trimacs up because I don't want any breeding. I don't want any anything that's going to take us extra time so the, the female i've put with the new fish that dave gave me from dave cichlid and the trimac is in jagger's old tank but i'll do a video on that next i will incorporate that video with him and the jag we've still got the jag and the extra spiller so yeah we'll show you that and they're together but i don't want to do a dead long video in one go um, you know what I'm like, I like shorter videos. Anyway, so, just wanted to update you on Jagger's upgrade, and I think personally that that will be his tank now for his life, because I don't know if he's going to get much bigger than he already is. Like I said, I reckon he's about 12 inches. He's possibly going to put another couple of inches on in the long run, but that tank is more than enough in my opinion. You might not think so, but I'm okay with it. So he will be staying in this tank. We'll see what happens with her. And the bigger she gets, I think the bigger she gets, the more at risk she will be. So we need to see how it goes. 
like I say, he probably, I'd say, 90% of the time, he's fine with her. The other 10, he's nasty. Um, and that can tend to be when we feed, or like, there, look, oh, it's going for her. He just, as he's upside down now. Look, it gets stuck. She absolutely makes him look a fool. Look, what is he doing? What is he doing? Yeah, he can never get nowhere near her, but she's a lot smaller than him, so be interesting to see when she's bigger, and she is growing fast. Anyway, I said it was going to be a short video, and I'm going on with myself, so we're going to cut it there. I'm not going to do um, a wrap-up, guys. I'm just going to end it here, and I don't know when the next video will be, but I'll do one as soon as I can. I'm just going to find gaps where I can and do videos, and yeah, I'll do one as soon as I can. But that's it. You know, that is the, the upgrade for Jagger and his little female Midas. And I am out. I will see you on the next video. See you later.